Bueno, 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 bueno. ¿Me escuchan bien? ¿Hay algún tipo de inconveniente en el sonido? No, nothing. Thank Everything. you. Okay. Okay, um, um, Hello. hello, Jancy. I'm truly sorry uh, for this inconvenience. Inconvenience. Thank you. Okay, eh, No, no, no. esperemos un par de minutitos mientras los demás eh, ingresan. Eh, de antemano, pues. Ah, muy bien. Eh, first of all, I'm totally sorry for this inconvenience that happens. It was something with So it happens to all the teachers. Uh, we lost connection with some, but here we go again. Okay, guys. Okay. We will continue watching this one. If I'm not wrong, the next participation uh, participant was Jancy. Jancy, how do I pronounce the number four? How do I? What? Now, ¿cómo pronuncio esto? No, uh, cut down on. Cut down on. Mm -hmm. Cut down on. Thank you, Morena. Next one. Keep up with. And okay, let me verify. Hmm. Marina, how do I pronounce this one? Put up with. Thank you, Julissa. Next one. Get along with. Thank you. And Vanessa, the last one. Take it off. Thank you so much, Vanessa. Okay, girls. Let me know what's the meaning of broke up with. Okay, broke up with. Mm -hmm. Maybe okay. I'm not if I'm if I broke up with her boyfriend with uh, some uh, when a couple of boys um separate for any reason and they finish uh, their relationship. Boys and girls. Too. Yes. <laughs> yes. <laughs> okay. I know. I know. Right now at this time we can see a couple of boys. A couple of girls, oh, boys and girls. But you are right, Morena. We use broke up in order to uh, talk about relationship when the relationship is over. Okay, right now, Brandy, let me know what's the meaning of hang up with. I came up with is like a makeup, like a give an example of something or have an idea. Yeah. Or not, I'm wrong. Not really. Okay. Just a second. Because in the in the example said Kevin came out with a great idea for us. Develop an idea, think of something. Mm. Um, or to suggest an idea or a plan. Yes. 
suggest an idea, Brandy. But you did a okay. great job. What about the, the next one? Keep up with. What's the meaning of keep up with? No, the second one is looking forward to. Mm -hmm. Staying or uh, waiting for something for an answer. Hmm. Expectation. Mm -hmm. Thank you. And right now, Jancy, what's the meaning of take care of? Cuidarte. In English. Take care of. <laughs> eh, to be careful to... <laughs> Okay. To keep the security of something, maybe. Yes, but first to think in this way, Jancy. What is the opposite of take care? It's obviously something dangerous, right? Okay, in this kind of cases, take care could be explained in a way. Take care means avoid dangerous things. Avoid. What's the meaning of avoid? Heavy. Mm -hmm. In English. <laughs> In English. <laughs> Try to do it. All right. Try to go to the to... opposite of just around. Around it. But don't worry. You did a great job. Okay. I know, guys. We got many, many of those uh, phrasal verbs that we don't know exactly the meaning, but it's time to verify and watch the rest of the video. Okay, here. Uh, we can hear. Thank you so much, Brandy. I uh, my apologies. Mm -hmm. Give me a second. Passionately, Kevin came up to look up the meaning right. Broken up with. Keep up. Jennifer has broken up with her boyfriend again. Kevin came up with a great idea for our class reunion. I'm not looking forward to typing my essay. Maybe I'll get it done professionally. My doctor says I'm overweight. I should cut down on fatty foods. Rob can keep up with his students in his Mandarin class. He should get a tutor. I can't put up with the noise on my street. I'll have to move. My girlfriend doesn't get along with her roommate. They're always fighting. Bill can take care of his own finances. He has an accountant manage his money. Okay, guys. Be excited for something to happen. End a romantic relationship. Keep pace with someone or something. Tolerate something you don't like. Reduce the quantity of something. Have a good relationship with someone. Be responsible for something. Think of something. Develop an idea. Okay, guys. Here are the meaning. Okay. The, the first one. Be excited for something to happen. What would be the price or bear that we will use to express this idea? Looking forward to... Thank you. Okay, we already know the B. What would be the B? Mm -hmm. Looking up with. Perfect. <laughs> Letter C. What's the, uh, what would be the price or bear that we will use? Put up. 
put up with. Mm -hmm. Number D. Cut down. Cut down. Mm -hmm. Letter E. Put down on. Yeah, but... letter E. Put down on. Okay, and the D. D S and David. Put up with. Put up with. Mm -hmm. Letter F. Get along with. Get along with. Letter D. Take care of. Take care of. And letter H. Came out with. with. Okay. <clears throat> Thank you. If you see, take care of it's more than try to avoid dangerous things. It's also try to be responsible. Okay, I know that you already memorized this answer, this meaning uh, with the price of her that we already watched. For the reason, let me ask it to you guys. Do you got any doubt or question about those price of her? ¿Tienen alguna duda o pregunta sobre ese, esos price server? Mm -hmm. Marina, yo le veo cara de poker face. Dígame, ¿tiene alguna preguntita? No, teacher. Yancy, do you got any doubt or questions? No. What about you, Maximo? Do you got any doubt or questions? No, teacher. Cool, cool. I understand. Right. Thank you. And what about you, Brandy? I'm okay. Maybe. It's okay, teacher. Thank you. Morena, Vanessa, and Julissa, do you have any doubt or questions? It's okay. Okay. Well, if everybody understands and everybody doesn't have any doubt, it's time to continue. And what will be the next times that we will watch? Well, guys, the next one will be this one. Morena, can you help me reading this? This part, just let me try to help it to you. ¿Puede ayudarme leyendo eso, Morena, por favor, y gracias? Uh, me. Yes, you. Okay. In this section, you will listen to a conversation about dating. See how they make suggestions. Thank you. You will. Okay. Uh, the main idea in this topic would be how to make suggestions how to provide like, advice or suggest something. But we will express that kind of suggestion talking about data. In order to understand the best way how to make a suggestion, try to pay attention in this video. Hi, let's begin by asking some questions. When, where, and how did you meet your wife, husband, or that special someone? Type your answers on our discussion box. As well, I want you to listen to the conversation and find out what Mike suggests James to do. I need a date. Part A. Listen and practice. This is so depressing. I haven't had a date since Angela broke up with me. What can I do? What about looking through the personal ads on the internet? That's how I met Amy. Actually, I've tried that. But the people you meet are always different from what you expect. Well, why don't you join an online dating service? A friend of mine met his wife that way. That's not a bad idea. Also, it might be a good idea to check out those discussion groups at the bookstore. Yeah, if I don't meet someone, at least I might find a good book. What are some other good ways to meet people? What do you suggest? Share with us. 
Okay, guys. What do you think about the video? <laughs> yes. A good idea. <laughs> yes, it's a good idea. Okay, I know. The guy is this desperate, desperate, mm -hmm. desperate, desperate people. Yes, I know. It's something really, really, um, uh, really serious uh, when uh, when someone broke up a relationship. I know that many people try to find uh, another date in order to fill that that empty thing off. But the main idea here is not got there. The suggestion of uh, this guy provide and then let me verify the name that might give us. No, try to pay attention in this part to be the specific. Sorry, guys. Okay. This one. And okay. Try to pay attention on those expressions. What about? What about looking? Well, why don't you join? Be specific in this one and the second one. This is the most important. Why? Because this expression well sounds like a suggestion that you will express a suggestion. Well, why? Don't you join an online dating service? Oh, well, why don't you do the house work? Oh, well, why, uh, why cannot help you? Okay. Also, this one. It might be. Ahí le está sugiriendo que puede ser tanto una buena o mala idea. Well. But right now, guys. Y que vimos, eh, hemos visto eso. Y tenemos esos ejemplos. Hagamos uno. At the end of this video, the teacher asked for a suggestions in this kind of cases. Imagine this. James is asking to you guys for a suggestion. What would be your suggestion to James? What sería su sugerencia para James? Suggestion about what? Are it the same? About dating. About dating. Okay. Yes. Try to give us an example, guys. Take your time. I will give it to you right now. Okay, five minutes. Try to make an example giving a suggestion about how to find a new date. Any doubt or question? I would say it it might be a good idea to wait uh, to wait uh, for meeting someone in person, probably uh, in other place. <laughs> yes, it could be. Uh, we can use the verb met or meet. Meet. Uh -huh. Meet people in another place face to face. Meet people face to face. It would be a good idea. Thank you. Maybe. What about you, Brandy? Or Maximo? Or whatever, or whoever that got an example? Well, yes. Maximo um, could be a good idea if you go to the church. 
<laughs> okay, let me verify the chart. Okay, it's not in the chart. Yes, it could be a good idea. Wait, uh, well, why don't you join to Tinder to try to find someone else? It could be another good idea. Oh, it might be. No, I consider that it's no good idea because mm -hmm. he. He yeah. feel bad for a uh, for a meeting, Amy, right? Mm -hmm. Yes, and maybe he he want to have a uh, interest for another company. I think. <laughs> well, Amy is the my girlfriend, and Mike is giving the option. It could be a bad idea. I agree with you, Morena, because we we don't met or we don't know the intention of the people on team. For the reason I agree with maybe the best way. And or, nowadays you don't know with the picture if it is a woman or a man. Yes, for the reason the best way to try to. Uh, Start a day or with someone else would be face yeah, to face. Probably to meet the famous guy that called Simon Levy, that it was a uh, <laughs> was <laughs> series on Netflix about him. Ah, yeah, the guy that uh, made some Levy, uh, three women, three women right? the Tinder Sindler is the mm -hmm. name. Yes. Tinder, Tinder, uh, Tinder is the name. Mm -hmm. Okay. It yes. might be a good idea mm -hmm. if you go to this um group. They have like a they have like a trip. They go to the beach. Mm -hmm. It might be I, a good idea to find or to meet people on a road trip. Or maybe uh, on the beach or on the supermarket. What about the supermarket, guys? Do you what, think... about, what about traveling mm -hmm. to Europe to find a. Yes. <laughs> uh, it's cool. He could mm -hmm. do everything that maybe he didn't do with when he was with her girlfriend and now he is single he tried to do everything that maybe he he stopped for that relationship in that time okay <clears throat> uh, a first idea i cannot share more details because we don't have any any background about this topic, about this conversation. We don't know if Danes have a bad relationship and that was the main reason that James has to broke up or maybe he cheated her, cheated on her, or she cheated on him. It could be too. But the reason, um, I don't know, maybe are not bad ideas but if i will be in his shoes i try to spend time on me and try to fix myself and try to grow up as a person and after that yes try to find a day and it will be oh it might be a good idea maybe find someone on a market supermarket library because you are more than able to to see face to face the people. Okay, guys. Es, veamos a ver. A ver esto. Okay. Okay, guys. It's almost time. 
just we got six minutes and almost uh, be on the part that I that we have a schedule for tonight. Uh, primero que nada, les pido perdón por el inconveniente que hubo con el Zoom. Eh, espero que este tema ha sido un poquito más eh, digerible. Y tenía pensado pues, ocupar los últimos minutos para poder practicar nuestra lectura. Ahora bien, debido a que no tenemos mucho tiempo, guys, eh, no practicaremos la lectura, pero intentaremos darle un, unas respuestas a las preguntas que hemos tenido. Muy bien, el día de ayer estábamos aprendiendo sobre get and have. Muy bien, nosotros sabemos que el get and have lo podemos ocupar para hablar sobre ciertas acciones que necesitamos que sean reparadas, refaccionadas, construidas o que alguien más se haga cargo de eso. Ahora bien, Maybe make a great question. When we have to use to, and we don't have to use to. Ok, nosotros vamos a agregar el to, guys, como vimos en la imagen que se encuentra en WhatsApp, en el momento que nosotros ocupamos get. Cuando nosotros ocupamos have, no es necesario. Si ustedes se fijan en la imagen que les envié el día de ayer, si se fijan, ahí aparecen dos estructuras. Muchas gracias. Más que todo, pongamos atención en las últimas dos. The first structure is subject plus have plus person plus verb. What will be the person in that part of the sentence? ¿Cuál será la persona que de cual vamos a agregar en esa parte de la sentence? Muy bien. La persona que le estaría ocupada haciendo la actividad que necesitaba. Por ejemplo, a plumber. Ok. Ok. Maybe. Oh, Brandy. Brandy had uh, a plumber fixing her sink. O sea, ella tiene ahorita un plumber ¿no? trabajando en eso. Esa es una forma que lo podemos ocupar. Have. And right now, what about get? Okay. Yeah. See or no? I know. I say it's false. I don't have nobody working here. I know. It's just an example. I know. I know that. Okay. So yes, a good example. Thank you. And the next <laughs> thing I will use your cat as an example. <laughs> <laughs> Okay, but and get is a little bit different. We use subject plus get plus the person that we will use to solve that uh, or fix that thing plus two plus verb. An example. Mm hmm. Okay, this is an example. This is just an example. Jancy could get her cat to be um, vacuum. No, it's not vacuum. Uh, to be maybe The meaning of this just be try to let me find to get a vaccine yes to get a vaccine thank you thank you so much brandy 
No, to get a shot. No, to get a vaccine. Let's get a vaccine. Thank you. I appreciate so much, Brandy. You're welcome. Okay. Yes. If you see. I mean, that kind of sentence we use. So. Okay, Gladys. Uh, okay, maybe. Se perdió de, de una pequeña explicación que estaba dando para poder solventar las preguntas que teníamos ayer. Yeah, my internet it was dead. Is dead. <laughs> hey. I'm right. Hey, congratulations. You already used a price out there. <laughs> okay. It's it's time to finalize the class, guys. Uh, thank you so much for, for being on time again. My sincere apology for the convenience on Zoom, but don't worry. I will upload uh, the class to YouTube as soon as possible. And tomorrow we will make a review about those topics that we already learned. Have a wonderful night and see you tomorrow. Bye-bye. Bye-bye. Bye. Thank you. Bye. Bye.